think you're ready to. And what exactly was your brilliant plan? I was going to talk to the teachers in the faculty room and then... That's pointless. What do you think a bunch of stupid teachers can do about it? But Takagi, this is just... It's kind of... Because of this, I... I should... I've got a question for you. What is it? Do you want to die? Or do you want to live? Well, that's... Um... They had the same idea as you. Let's see how it works for them. Sir! Sir! You want to live, right? Then stick with me. Let's go, chubby. I should let my dad know that I'm all right. Let me use your cell. I understand that he's a police officer. We can't even connect to 110. I know this secret number that he told me not to call unless it's an emergency. It got through. Dad? Hello? Takashi? Is that you? Dad, listen. Daddy, we're at school and there's been... Hello, Takashi? You must have got this number from Ray. Is Ray okay? Is she with you? Daddy, what's the matter? Can't you hear me? Listen carefully. The entire city is Daddy. in panic mode right now. You need to get out of there. You understand? The city is already in panic mode. You need to evacuate. No service? But I just called him. I don't understand. Ray! Takashi... My dad, he didn't know that it was me at all. He didn't even know me. <laughs> Takagi, I, I know it's against school rules, but do you have your cell phone on you? I'm a straight-A student. Besides, even if I had one, who would I call? Well, the police, maybe? God, you're so stupid. Look how serious this is. There's no way people haven't called them already. But yet, we haven't heard a single siren. So now you know. So this is happening all over? Gee, you think? 
I'm sure the police have been dealing with this already, but look how things are. I wonder if we should call the self-defense force or something. I wouldn't expect much from them. I know that they can't conduct any defense or public security operations without the government's order, but... That's not what I meant. Well, what did you mean exactly? Ugh. They're just like the police. What do you think would happen if people were eating people in all the cities out there? Listen, there are 130 million people. How many of them do you think work for the self-defense force? And what if the same things have been happening inside the self-defense force? <gasps> Come on! We need to go! Uh, okay! Jesus! The only reason I have to stay with this dumbass is because Kamoro is in here. I am such a nice person. of the Kendo Club, Psycho Busujima. A sophomore. What's your name, kid? Ishii. Ishi. Kazu. <coughs> Ishii, you did a great job protecting Dr. Marikawa. I commend your courage. You do know what happens to you once you get bitten. Do you want your parents or friends to see you like that? If the answer is no, I will end your life as painlessly as I can. But I've never killed anyone before. Uh, please do that. Oh, wait! What are you gonna do? You're the school doctor. I got it. But stay out of it. This young man is going to die with honor. And I'm going to make sure that he does. some things that would come just shut me. up you chubby geek lock the door so they won't come in I, I locked it are you gonna use them as weapons you're one of those basement shut-ins one of those military nerds or gun geeks aren't you come on at least you've seen this thing before i mean it was in that mel gibson movie a nail gun and it's gas hell yeah we won't be able to carry it around if it was one of those compressor types right God, you're fat and stupid. So you like movies? Don't be ridiculous. I'm a genius, so I know everything. <gasps> we got an extra tank and the nails. We're all set. Why are you so calm, cool, and collected? They're coming! They're in the hallway! <laughs> Weighs around four kilograms. It's as heavy as some old assault rifle. But I can't stabilize my aim this way. I need to attach a sight to it. Hey, you! Are you listening to me? <laughs> you're, you're on a...
Are you ready? Yeah! Now turn it! Please put sugar on top. Uh, all right. Uh, I'm okay. I didn't like most of you fucks then, and I sure as hell don't like you now. Hey, Takagi, can I, can I ask you something? What? Well, why are you with me? Why? Because I'm such a nice person. <sighs> yeah, I can see that. Oh, well. Hey, you're on the ball all of a sudden. Something clicking you or what? I think I found my calling. Fire hose. Not too shabby. I figured the water pressure would be strong enough. Don't you remember during the fire drill when we were in junior high, Hisashi and you got... Yeah, I remember. I think it should be okay now. How I admire your optimism. You sure about this? Let's go. Where do we run to? To my house. Go there and get supplies we need and meet up with other people who haven't turned yet. Work together and get someplace safe. Sounds like a plan to me. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Now that I know my dad's okay... Oh, we should probably call your house to make sure they're all right, too. Waste of time. Nobody's home. My dad won't be back in town till next week. And my mom's a school teacher, so she won't be home until after five. Besides, they get on my nerves. <laughs> well, their parent, that kind of comes with the job. I didn't really mean that. The truth is, I was a little scared. Look at this place. And my mom. She's someplace just like this. when something hits their bodies, the big dumbasses. Their senses are dead. They only respond to the sound. Most likely they can't see either. Otherwise, they wouldn't bump into the locker. Well, what about heat? I'm sure we'll get plenty of opportunities to find out. Let's go. So we're... we're going outside? You think we're hanging around here? I kinda... I hate walking. And that's why you're so fat! You need to put down the Walmart Cheetos and exercise! <laughs> Two at a time, believe me, no problem. And I wouldn't think twice about doing it. But they come at you in packs. And don't be fooled, they're a lot stronger than they look. Once they grab you, it's hard to get loose. Wow, I'm impressed. Oh, I hate these stupid floor maps! Jeez! What 
you're wearing isn't exactly made for running. Clothes or your life, which is more important? Uh, both are. Uh, what was that? It came from the faculty room. If you keep shooting them, how will we learn about them? You know, you could help me fight them too. You stupid fat idiot! That's what I have you for. The magazine is almost empty. You think that's my problem? Hurry up and just reload it! But they're, they're right behind you. Hmm? See? Huh? Your Honor! Oh no, I'm out! Get away! Get away! Takagi! You know the school doctor, Marikawa, right? And I'm Saiko Busujima from Class 3A. I'm Takashi Kumuro from Class 2B. Miss Busujima, I remember you won the national championship last year. I'm Rei Miyamoto. I'm in the Spear Martial Arts Club. Oh, and I'm... I'm Kota Hirano from Class B, just FYI. <laughs> nice to meet you. <gasps> Why are you guys being all warm and fuzzy? Uh -huh. Why are you being so polite to her, Miyamoto? You flunked last year. You're the same age. She's not your elder. What are you talking about, Takagi? Now talk to me like I'm stupid! I'm smarter than all of you combined! You should be lucky I'm even in the same school as you! I'm... I'm... <coughs> it's okay. That's enough. Look at me. All of these blood stains. Now mom will have to take it to the cleaners. I can't. 